Are you suffering from dead Wi-Fi zones in your home? Slow speeds in the bedroom? Buffering in the backyard? Well, let's fix that. I'm the Wi-Fi guy, and today you're going to learn exactly which mess systems work best for big homes. If your home is over 2,500 square feet, has multiple floors, thick walls, or dead zones, your traditional router is probably maxed out. That's where Mesh Wi-Fi steps in. It gives you blanket coverage, strong speeds, and way less frustration. A mesh Wi-Fi system uses a main router plus satellites or nodes that talk to each other wirelessly. You get seamless roaming, automatic network optimization, and no more reconnecting as you walk from room to room. I'm Jerry Jones, the Wi-Fi guy, and I like to make tech make sense. I have tons of videos on YouTube to help you make sense out of Wi-Fi and home networking. I even have a course called the Home Network Mastery Course that helps you set up, troubleshoot, and upgrade your home network like a pro. So what are the things you want to look for in a mesh system? Here are the things that matter. Coverage range, as in square footage. Your speed, especially if you stream in 4K or play games. Band support dual, tri, or quad band. How many ethernet ports does it have, which you can use for wired devices or setting up a backhaul? And hopefully, it'll have a smartphone app to make setup simple, as well as robust security and parental controls. So here are what I consider the top three mesh Wi-Fi devices. Number one is the Netgear Orbi 960. The Orbi 960 is the Ferrari of mesh Wi-Fi systems. It has quad band Wi-Fi 6E speed. Speeds up to 10.8 gigabits per second. It covers 9,000 square feet with three units. It includes a 2.5 gigabit per second WAN port for multi-gig internet instead of the usual one gig ports. It has eight ethernet ports total. It also has advanced security via Netgear Armor. The Orbi 960 is perfect for high performance users, gamers, or smart homes loaded with devices. The Orbi 960 is one of the most expensive mesh systems on the market. It's a powerhouse, but be ready to pay for that performance. Next up, if you want easy setup, smart integration, and solid speed, the Eero Pro 6E delivers tri-band Wi-Fi 6E speed up to 2.3 gigabits per second wireless throughput, covers about 6,000 square feet with three units. It works with Alexa and supports Thread for smart homes. You get two Ethernet ports per node. You also get automatic updates and built-in security with Eero Secure Plus. The Eero Pro setup takes minutes and is extremely reliable for streaming, zooming, and smart devices. Each Aero Pro 6E unit only comes with two Ethernet ports, so you'll need a switch if you want to wire up several devices in each room. Now, if you're looking for a serious bang for your buck, the Deco XE75 is unbeatable. It has tri-band Wi-Fi 6E speed, covers up to 7,200 square feet with three units, up to 5.4 gigabits per second combined speeds between all the bands, AI-driven mesh optimization for smart device routing, and you can get optional Home Shield security tools. The TP-Link XE75 goes for under $300 for three-pack. This is the value king for big homes with multiple users. The TP-Link comes with Home Shield for security, but some of its most robust parental controls and threat protection sit behind a paywall. So let's break down a side-by-side -side comparison. The Orbi 960 offers premium performance, is great for gamers and multi-gig users. The Eero Pro 6E offers smooth setup and is excellent for smart homes. The Deco XE75 offers affordable power and is great for most households. Before you buy, always check your square footage and your ISP's internet speed. Also count your devices. If you live in a multi-story home, aim for a three-pack minimum. 
I link all three mesh systems below so you can check current prices and choose which system fits your home and style. If this video helped, give it a like and share it with someone struggling with slow Wi-Fi. Also, please subscribe for more no-nonsense tech advice. Remember, I'm the Wi-Fi guy and I like to make tech make sense.